Hi guys, my name is uh, Stuart Denker and a senior bartender at Sugar Hall. Uh, Sugar Hall for me uh, is a place where you can come and have fun with your friends. It's a place where we uh, like to say, uh, we call it fun dining. Uh, it's a great place to come and have a glass of rum and also maybe a pork chop, one of my favourites. And uh, currently we have the most uh, extensive uh, stocks of rum, about 85 bottles I think. So yeah, it's a good place. Uh, come down, have fun and see me. Uh, no, it's actually my second time making the eggnog. The first time uh, I actually made an eggnog was about a year ago. Didn't turn out too well, but over the past few months, I think uh, I have managed to make a good eggnog. It's one of those things where I think practice makes perfect. For this version, I think it was about four times until uh, I finally settled down with the method and how I actually wanted the eggnog to turn out. Actually, it turned out pretty well. The first time I had this drink was when I was about 13 years old. I think it was at my grandmother's house uh, during Christmas. Uh, didn't really like it at first. Uh, I guess uh, I don't take on too well to creamy drinks, but I think as uh, my palate develops, uh, I kind of take kind of taken on a liking to creamy drinks. Yeah. Uh, the method that I'm actually using is I'm using a I'm using a hand blender, so that actually helps the eggs uh, emulsify with the sugars and also um, get everything and bind it together. And for my ingredients, the only thing that I'm switching up is I'm changing the regular sugar to uh, a black cardamom syrup, uh, which is homemade, and also uh, I'm using uh, almond essence. So actually, what the what I'm trying to achieve is actually to bridge the to bridge the gap um, of us being a rum bar and also um, bringing in uh, influences from the Caribbean, uh, which is using almonds and uh, spices and also uh, rum as the base of the Basically, for someone who hasn't tried eggnog before, uh, I would say it's a creamy drink, uh, very velvety, very textured, uh, has a lot of um, character to the drink, and yeah, it, it's always there's always a first time in trying a drink. And this is my version of an eggnog. My version of the eggnog will be available at Sugar Hall throughout the festive period. Uh, if anybody walks through our doors throughout any time, uh, I will be more than happy to make you guys an eggnog.